And for those who enjoy this channel and would love to support us financially, please feel free to hit that donate link. We'd greatly appreciate it. God bless. Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be discussing how natural selection is a tautology. So I'll go ahead and begin. Um, evolution has faced numerous criticisms over the years. Some of the most interesting of the criticisms, in my opinion, though, have been in regards to evolution's ability to be falsified. You know, in other words, could evolution be shown to be wrong? Philosopher Karl Popper believed that, you know, for theories to be scientific, they had to be falsifiable. If a theory or idea had no way in which it could be proven wrong, then it just wasn't science. Now, a common and arguably overlooked criticism of evolution is that natural selection is a tautology. Now, I'll first, you know, define what a tautology is. It's a statement, you know, that will always be true and therefore can never be wrong. And while I realize that, you know, creationists do accept that variations occur within kinds, um, and a lot of the evidence for natural selection is just evidence for variation between kinds, I still think we need to point out how and why natural selection is outside of the realm of science. So let me explain why it's a tautology. You know, evolution's basic assertion is that the fittest organisms survive and reproduce, you know, producing offspring suitable for the environment they're currently in. Meanwhile, those unable to survive are weeded out through natural selection and the more fit organisms are, you know, they have a legacy and they keep spreading and they outproduce the less fit organisms. See, the problem is that this will always be true and can't be wrong. There's just never going to be an instance of an unfit organism out surviving and out reproducing more fit organisms. Because if, a, let's say, a seemingly unfit organism is better equipped to survive, reproduce, when compared to seemingly more fit organisms, then the unfit organism is by definition fit or more fit than the other organisms that looked fit. So in other words, I mean, there's just no way a less fit organism could be more successful and output reproduce fit organisms because it's just, it's just not possible. I mean, there's just no way that natural selection can be, you know, the basic premise of natural selection can be wrong. So that's why it's a tautology. I mean, there's just no way that there can be an unfit organism out surviving out reproducing fit organisms because if they are able to out survive and out reproduce then they're by definition fit so because this area area of evolution can't be proven wrong i like to say you know that it shouldn't be considered science i just don't think that i mean it's just there's just no way it can be wrong and i think this is something that creationists need to try to you know bring up a little bit um more often in my opinion but um, when, especially, you know, with the debates, I think that's a good thing to add on there. But, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I enjoyed making this video and recording this for you, so God bless.